customs officials in Thailand say the illegal ivory trade network is changing its tactics to avoid a crackdown on the underground trade. VOA's Caroline Turner tells us more. Thai officials displayed 102 pieces of ivory worth around 10 million baht, or 295,000 U.S. dollars. The confiscated items were found during a package scan using an x-ray machine on Friday at the airport. The package declared as marble was originally sent from Brazzaville in the Republic of Congo and was en route to Laos via Ethiopia, Thailand, Malaysia and Singapore. Authorities said the underground trade network had changed its tactics. Africa. We often confiscated ivory from the common routes from Africa through Thailand and to Laos. Later, they used other routes. We also found them. Now, they have changed again. Police also said that both human and non-human DNA on the ivory would help to further the investigation. The illegal trade has its network. We have to collect evidence. Officials from forensic science will also take part in this to collect DNA, both human and non-human DNA. The DNA can tell us if they are African or Asian elephants. Thai officials say that this year alone they have confiscated more than 12 million U.S. dollars worth of ivory smuggled into Thailand. Under a new law passed in January, possession of African ivory for sale in Thailand is prohibited. Much of the ivory smuggled into Thailand is shipped to China and Vietnam to meet demand. Carolyn Turner, VOA News.